Good morning, super cool party people, and welcome back to the beach. All right, today is Saturday. I'm backing into the room to not lose the light. And first thing on the agenda for today is the rehearsal at the venue for how to walk in a line. So I'm pretty much ready to go. I just need to put on my sash because Bride Tribe time. I know it's been like a year and a half, but here it is. So I'm gonna put it on now. And then I think I can head downstairs to meet everybody. So that's exciting. And then I guess it'll be lunch after or breakfast after because I gotta meet them in seven minutes. That's not time to eat. And we have to be at the venue in like 23 minutes. So yeah, but I will try to bring you along the day as best as I can, but we will see how it goes because I gotta learn how to walk in a straight line and then remember it. <laughs> getting married tomorrow? Yes, I am. Are you excited? Nah. Psh. <laughs> no, I totally am. It's gonna be great. We just learned how to walk down an aisle. I think we did well. Well, yeah, except I was staring at Tiffany the whole time instead of Mark, but you know. Actually, I think it was your mom, but well. you know, whatever. It's all good. <laughs> We have made it to Target. I'm very excited. We're picking up some thank you card things and trying to get something for Pam's dad's cane because it's got a sticker on it right now. We might just have to get like goo gone. But yeah, Target, it's so exciting. Yay. All right, so I just got back to the room. It was a very busy morning of learning how to walk. Um, I think it'll be okay. There's like a few very specific things that they want us to do like square your shoulders to the bride and as she walks move with her and then fix she's got a stupid train so i have to fix the train so like i have to hand my bouquet off to her sister fix the train get my bouquet back and then later when pam wants to hand me her bouquet i have to hand my bouquet to her sister again because you can't hold the bridal bouquet and another bouquet apparently Apparently that's protocol. So yeah, so we looked around the estate for a little bit and then we went to Denny's and had like a big group breakfast brunch thing, uh, which was nice. And then Pam and I had a few last minute errands to run, like getting some thank you cards and I went to get some sunscreen because my nose got a little bit burnt yesterday and I wanna go in the pool after we get our nails done. So I don't wanna, you know, burn my face because wedding tomorrow and I I mean I don't have full coverage makeup so that's why I had troubles covering it but better to not be burnt so I'm just gonna hang out in my room for about half an hour 40 minutes until we have to go meet up to go to the nail place but then once our nails are done we are good other than dinner tonight we have no plans so I'm very excited about that currently it is 22 degrees out and it is quite high tide the beach is closed to driving and yeah, here's my full view from up here. It is not bad at all. But yeah, I think I'm just gonna have some downtime because today has been busy so far, getting close. Um, and then still got stuff to do. So downtime for me and then 
more downtime later, but yeah. Mm, yeah. Mm, yeah. All right, so it is just about time to go meet up to go get our nails done. I don't think I'm gonna bring a camera because I just wanna like zen and chill out. So I will see you afterwards. And I think I'm gonna go in the pool later, like I said. So yeah, see you later. Alrighty, looks like it is time to go back down to the pool. Got my card so I don't lock myself out like Pam and her hubby did the other day. Down we go, should be good. Got sunscreen on this time. Hopefully it won't burn because that could be bad tomorrow. thing we were going to the pool and I went to the pool so I got GoPro footage there um, Wow I am glammed AF I did not realize um, and I did it myself anyway it is about six o'clock we're going for dinner at seven so I've put my face on I am wearing pajamas though because we're not about that dress life until we have to be about that dress life um, and I'm just waiting basically until it's time to go I'm watching HGTV because we know that I love HGTV. So yeah, just been chilling, it's been great. I think after dinner, everybody's gonna go to karaoke, which I think I'm gonna pass on because I'm not a drinker. So I feel like it just won't be enjoyable, which is fine, I'll come back to the hotel, I'll finish writing that speech that I keep not writing. I mean, I've got it written in my head and partially in my phone, so it'll be fine. But yeah, that's the plan for this evening. I'm doing a time lapse right now because sunset. And I'm um, just gonna chill a little bit longer and then probably in about 20 minutes put on the dress finally. It's a cute one. I've worn it before. I'm sure I've showed it before. It's this, it's polka dotted and it's blue. And I think it's great. I love it. So I will check in with you. You know, why do I say this? Why do I always say this? I got my dress on and even though it doesn't really go I'm wearing my jacket because I'm not I'm not about being cold <laughs> when we go out and the place it's called Krabby Joe's and it's like right on the water so like what if like what if it's cold <laughs> anyway I'm just trying to figure out when we're leaving now it's about 6 30 I can't see my watch but I know it's about 6 30 so yeah should be good also oh I don't know if I showed you my nails these are my nails they won't focus any closer those are my nails uh, the guy did a terrible job on them. I asked for gel nail polish and he gave me gel nails and they aren't even shaped to look the same. But it's fine. It's fine. So, like this one here, you can't, you can't really see, but it goes boop, but it's fine. Anyway, um, it, oh, my sash, I almost forgot my sash. Must have sash for all wedding related things. All right, I'm not gonna bring the camera because I think it's just gonna be dark in the restaurant. So I'll see you when I'm back from dinner. Okay, so I just got back home. It is 10 o'clock, home, hotel room, whatever. Almost everybody else went to karaoke. Actually, you know what? Her, his brother and sister didn't go. His mom and dad didn't go. The other four, you know, it's probably about half went to karaoke. I was just like, no hard pass like it's 10 already i have to edit a video and i want to you know have some sleep tonight it's gonna be a long day tomorrow so parting words were don't drink too much and hydrate a lot so best of luck to them but because it was like the reception rehearsal dinner reception dinner at the re rehearsal dinner i think i don't know anyway that means gifts for wedding party oh the bag is much prettier on this side anyway so I don't understand. She says we'll understand tomorrow, but this is one of those hand muffs. 
which is really nice and like but florida so <laughs> but it's nice i like it and i would love to like have an excuse to use it in the future <laughs> Next, and I'm actually really excited about this because I was like, oh my god, I don't have a purse or something to put like my phone and my camera and stuff in. But look, she got us purses, matching purses for me and her sister. And it opens. I was struggling hardcore at the restaurant. And inside, there's a box, which I can't get open. And there is a necklace and earrings in here. So that's awesome. I did bring down a necklace. Um, and then I was like, oh, I don't have earrings. But... We're good. We got those. Those are nice. So we are good for tomorrow. I think what I'm going to do now is I have to shower again because I put product in my hair, but I need to have not product in my hair for tomorrow. So that's fine. I don't want to shower tomorrow morning. So I need to shower and then I kind of want to get my stuff ready to go because in the morning Pam's going to bring her stuff up here. We're gonna go for breakfast. We're gonna do a snack run because we're gonna be at the estate where we're getting ready from like 11 o'clock until the end of the night, basically. The wedding's at four. So she could bring all her stuff up here because I have her dress, I have her veil, blah, blah, blah. And then when it's time for us to grab that and go, we will grab it all from my room. So fingers crossed we won't forget anything. But yeah, so I'm gonna go now and I am going to try to get myself organized and I will check in with you later. Ow. Okay, so it took me a while, but I finally dragged my butt back into the shower, so my hair is clean. I don't think it likes the Florida water, though. It must be, like, hard water or something, because it it's not happy, but it's fine. I don't like drinking it much, either. I mean, I've got, like, my filter in here, so it makes it a little better, but I don't know. There's, a, like, at the restaurant, it tasted dusty. Can water taste dusty? I don't know. Anyways, it's 11.30. Did I just say that? I don't know. Um... And I think it's time to end the vlog here. I've started slowly collecting my things. I have a pile over there. Need that, need that, need that, need that. So I kind of know what I need, but I'm sure I'll collect more as the evening goes on. But I figure I should end the vlog here so I can try to get a decent night's sleep because Pam and I are meeting up at about nine tomorrow to run some errands before we have to be at the venue at 11. So, with that, I'm going to say thank you for coming along on today's adventure, and I'll see you tomorrow. We do completely different things, because somebody's getting married. Good night.